You may not think that a chassis part is related to the ADOS system on a vehicle, but it is. Anytime the alignment angles change on a vehicle, you're possibly changing the thrust angle or total toe on the vehicle. This can occur due to your own adjustments or let's say slack in the control arm where the bushing starts to flex, increases camber, camber causes a pull condition, but with these you need to be mindful that every time the suspension is changed, you're changing the ADOS system. In other words, that camera that's mounted on the windshield or let's say a radar assembly that's in the front of the vehicle, well every time you change the attitude of the vehicle, well you're changing where that is pointed. In other words, if you do not have the right thrust angle, well you can wind up having the vehicle canted to one direction. And When the vehicle is canted to one direction to make it go straight down the road, well that camera could be pointed at bushes, barriers, other vehicles coming in the opposite direction. So make sure when you're inspecting a suspension on a newer vehicle that has an ADOS system, make sure you're looking at the suspension and also the alignment angles. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.